Eileen from Star Brands. Today, we are here at Little India along Lebo Pasa, which is the market road in Penang. standing in front of the Sri Maha Mariamman Temple, the oldest Hindu temple in all of Malaysia. Let's go inside to take a look. This temple is the oldest Hindu temple in all of Penang. During Thapuzan, more than 20,000 devotees pray to be granted with good health, a husband or a son and many other things. There are a lot of symbolic items, especially the bells on the door. It's said higher that we are coming in and going out. So we ask, we are now I'm com coming to tell the God. God. I'm coming so I should just fly up. So I go in there and just showing to them. And this one showing that she's in and out, the same thing. Uh. This right here is a rice porridge known as Adi. Usually consumed by Hindus when they are during the fasting month. Here with Muhammad Adesh, owner of the famous Teh Tari shop in Little India. This is one of the best cups of Teh Tari and has been pulled to perfection by Muhammad Adesh. Let's take a sip. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. These stalls sell numerous local goodies. These little gathering of stalls will really enable you to experience so much of the Malaysian food. I'm here with Mohammed Anif at a famous curry puff shop. This shop has been here since Tamrin, the owner's uncle, started it. Satu curry puff? Sering itu. Sering it? Okay, okay, no problem. Alright, one. Bungkus, huh? Okay. These curry puffs are snacks known to the Indian community as samosa. Here, they have a huge variety of samosa. All of the recipes come straight from Chennai in India. The sari is a traditional Indian costume worn by women. Here, there are numerous sari stores in Little India filled with vibrant coloured clothes. Many of these clothes are meant to be worn on a daily basis and some only for special certain occasions. This bright blue sari is a sari that can be worn on any occasion. If you all are into Indian jewellery, take a look at this shop. We all know that Indians are famous for wearing extremely heavy jewellery. And now we know where all these jewellery come from. This little shop called RK Fancy House, right in the heart of Penang Town, Little India. Okay. What I have in my hands right now is an extremely beautiful turquoise set of jewellery normally worn by Indian ladies at grand functions, such as weddings. <coughs> I'm here at New Life Hairdressing Saloon. Indian men always come for a haircut. Let's take a look inside the shop. This here is, your name sir? Bussottaman. And this one is? Right. Nice to meet you sir. You're both hairdressers? Cut hair. Right. There are lots of things to see, do and experience in Little India here in the heart of Penang. So the next time you're in Penang, don't forget to drop by Little India. This is Eileen from Starbreds saying, enjoy our video.